it just seems like there's a general sense of dysfunction on offense right now. Do you feel like you guys are not on the same page? Um, I don't think I, I don't think we feel dysfunctional. I think at times, you know, the game sways either way. That that's what football is. Um, I think we've seen a lot of things that you know we weren't, we weren't expecting to see, or you know, also I can't discredit the other players. I mean, they're D one football players just like we are. So I mean. The dysfunction, I, I don't see it. I think people made plays, maybe they made more plays, but um, I think we I think we have all the pieces. I think we messed well together as a group, and I think we're gonna come back. You know. Zemo, Pat talked about self-scouting during this five week. Do you have to be perhaps more critical now, given the start you've had and the record and in any effort to try to turn this around? I think, of course, you have to be critical when you're losing. I don't think we need to start pointing fingers. I don't think we need to completely throw away what we're doing. I think, again, it just comes to playing a clean game. It comes to playing a complete game and just executing more, executing what we have. And I think, I mean, I have no doubt we're going to be okay and moving forward, we'll do what's necessary to get a win. Well, Virginia Tech had, uh, you know, one of the lowest ranked uh, run defenses in the country. What what were they able to do to kind of take the run away from you guys tonight? I mean, I think they just played hard. I think we played hard as well. But like I said, it's a game of inches. It's literally a game of inches. We'll have to go back to the film before I can even say anything about that. But. Like I said, it's a game of inches, and there were times where we were tackled away from it being not a one-yard game, but maybe a, a, an explosive. I know I left things out there on the field. So, like I said, we're going to have to go back to the film room before I can even say anything about that. Steve-O, what are you feeling right now? Well, I feel, I mean, I'm, honestly, I'm, I'm a natural competitor, as are Everyone on my team, everyone on the offense, everyone on the defense, we're natural competitors. So what are we feeling? We never feel good when we take a loss. But like you said, we're also not gonna let it get us down. We're not gonna get let it, let us spiral. We're not gonna do any of those things. We're gonna keep going to work every day. We're gonna keep trusting in each other, and we're gonna stay together. That's the most important part. And we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna pull through. We're gonna we're gonna perform better as a group and. Yeah. Steve, uh, it, it seemed like there were a lot of mental errors today. I mean, there's false starts, there's a delay of games in the second half. What what leads to that? Is, it, is there just maybe a misunderstanding of the game plan or in that situation? Or you guys, do you feel like you're prepared to run two minute offense? Yeah, I'll, I'll attribute a lot of that to the crowd, as well as, like I said, man. Um, like we definitely left some things out there on the field, um, but I don't think it was any one thing. Um, there's a lot of things that go on in the huddle and coming from the sideline, and there's just a lot of things that go on that in the in, in the midst of the game can just affect all of that. And I can't really, like I said, I can't really pinpoint one thing. But like I said, we're gonna we're gonna get it all figured out, and we're gonna put it together. And, Going to be better than do you feel oh, one more last one here? Do you feel like there was a lack of urgency on that final offensive possession? I mean, you guys were down by three scores and play clock was getting low. I mean, it just seemed like there wasn't a lot of urgency. Would you agree with that? Not necessarily. No. I will say again, the atmosphere was intense and mm -hmm. it's loud out there, and that can a lot of there's a lot of noise, so that can really affect. What's going on? Steve, thank you very much.